Right guys, I'm going to be making a video on my Samsung Galaxy Z Fold uh, 5 and um, let me just get this thing to start up right so it's on the side just need the stylus I don't know where I put the stylus oh my god, where is that thing? okay, I found it right, so I'm going to be playing War Robots and this is a mobile version. Obviously, this is on the Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. My Steam Deck is next to it. Uh, what I want to show today is that basically I can use a DualSense controller with the Steam Deck. So I, I don't actually need to use to touch the screen. I'm just using the stylus because it's much quicker. You know, if I wanted to do something, it's just quicker. It says, um, achieve a double kill 10 times. Okay, 10 times double kills. I'm not going to watch anything right now because obviously I'm doing this video. Most of the videos I've been doing uh, have been on um, at night. So obviously people wouldn't have known whether or not I was using a phone. Uh, so I just wanted to show that this does work with a DualSense controller. Check this out. I need to press the PlayStation logo. Look what happens. It's gonna connect, there you go. The light goes on. That's, uh, and now look, it's working. And to activate, I just need to press X and um, you know, to select. So I just wanted to show this video because I think a lot of people, I mean, people would know that I'm telling the truth, but not everyone would uh, understand that you can't play this game with a DualSense controller. The only reason that the Type-C cables inside this is because I'm charging it up. Sometimes I don't have this charged, so it just makes it easier if it's like this. Right, so I'm gonna show you today that I'm not even going to touch the screen. I'm just gonna play this game all using a uh, DualSense controller. And uh, this is a Samsung Galaxy Z Fold 5. As you can see, it's a mobile phone. I actually bought this for one thousand one hundred dollars. Um, you can you can buy these on eBay for about nine hundred and fifty, I think. I mean, it's not that expensive now on, on on eBay. They are expensive phones. I'm not saying they're cheap, but I'm saying um, some people do sell them for nine fifty just to you know. I mean, not everyone is a Samsung fan, so. I mean. Why am I showing this? Uh, because I haven't seen anybody, I've not seen anyone demonstrating the DualSense controller working on the Samsung as a, a gamepad. I tried this on the iPad mini. I tried to use the DualSense controller on iPad mini. It didn't work out. It didn't work the same way. I mean, it recognizes that it's a DualSense controller connecting to the iPad mini, but it just doesn't work the same way. You understand so um i like this control because everything works on this so i can heal i can use my mothership ability i can spin around this guy is destroying me um i can spin around ah damn i can spin around i can control the direction i can select where i need my robot to go to I can select the robot that I want to use. I can drop the remote assault down. I can uh, call in Mothership uh, Beam. I can heal the robot. I can use all the abilities for the Titan without ever touching the screen of the phone. So as the phone is there, I, I don't even need to touch it. Look at that. I use the Mothership ability without touching the screen. So what I'm talking about basically is this entire game, the whole game that I'm playing, is all coming from the DualSense controller. The only reason the, um, the controller is connected with um, is connected with a with a USB-C um, cable is, like I said, it's I'm actually charging up the USB um, uh, controller. You know that this, uh, these um, PlayStation controllers are, um, what, what, oh my God, I was getting shot by that dude. I was trying to concentrate. 
Listen, um, the, the DualSense controller needs to be powered, right? Because these DualSense controllers do work that way. You understand? So this DualSense controller needs uh, to have power in it. So basically, when you leave these DualSense controllers for quite a while, as I have done, then uh, it's, it kind of, uh, it's, it loses a bit of functionality. You understand? So the only reason it's connected right now is uh, because of the functionality. So I'm not saying that I need to have the cable actually attached. I don't need the cable attached to the, to the actual Samsung. I mean, sorry, to the, to the DualSense controller. I don't need the cable attached. Um, but like I said, I need to charge up the, the, the gamepad. You understand? You know what I mean? So that's the only reason why I'm trying to explain why I've got this uh, the Type C cable in the gamepad itself. So it's not attached to the to the um, Samsung phone. That cable and this cable are not the same cable. Ah, uh, let's see what kind of robot is this? Is this another? This looks like um a mouse. Looks like another mouse. A good thing is he had, he hasn't seen me. He doesn't realize it yet. <laughs> but I mean, this is so cool, man. I, I'm, I'm really enjoying this, uh, this fact that I can play with the gamepad. I'm serious. It has really changed. It has changed the way I played the game. And um, it's changing for the better, you know? Oh, that's a Titan. That's that Rook Titan, you know, the one that flies up in the air. All right, let me use my ability and mash this guy up a bit because that titan is the strongest titan the one behind it isn't that good if we can kill this titan oh my god he's aiming at me now <laughs> he's, trying, he's trying to look i'm using my mothership ability that's what i'm saying this is so cool oh my god he's, he wants to hit me <laughs> he sees the damage you saw the damage i did to his titan it was a lot of damage right i'm gonna use my luchundo now I, I think I've, I've explained myself like, uh, man, you know, you know one thing, no, but th that guy will get it. Uh, I don't even know where this guy's uh, thing is. Right. So basically I, I like the fact of, of using this. Um, I like the fact of using this uh, thing um sorry this um the uh, the gamepad man why doesn't anyone help attack that titan at least attack it no one no one's attacking the titan they just look at that it's like he's asleep why why don't you wake up you know seriously what the hell nobody was helping me nothing they just they're ignoring me and and it's like it's like you're fighting alone you know one thing let me let me go behind this guy and try and cause some damage he's attacking somebody else hopefully i can just help and destroy this dude look, look at that look at the damage i'm doing to him come on let me get an assist yes we destroy that that um that uh, titan that thing's gone right so like i was saying you know what i'm gonna use my behemoth I've got um, two crew bane, uh, the present or whatever it's called, this uh, thing, this weapon. The weapon that this has is very good, the new weapon. You can actually take out titans with the weapon that this uh, dude has. So to get the ability, I just press the RB, which is the, um, the smaller buttons on this. And uh, if it had a different ability, you, play, you press the LB, which is the other button here. I need this thing to land. There we go. And check this out. Look look at the damage I want to do to this dude. It's just that that new weapon isn't powered. Look at the damage. It does a lot of damage, that, the new heavy weapon. It's like a laser. And the way it fires, it's like a shotgun effect. But it's a laser weapon. Right? I can't watch any of the trailers. Right. So, there you go. I got 44,000 gold with this one. And for whatever reason, it never gives me enough uh, silver. Right, it says get double kills. Okay, I wasn't focusing on the double kills. 
right so most of the time what i do in the morning is i'll just be watching the trailers you know watching the stuff on this uh so i'll actually explain what this is saying let me just move this other thing out of the way it says n n n clan rank points 240 destroy at least two enemies at uh in the first 45 seconds of each battle so three at least two enemies in 45 seconds how is that possible how are you gonna do that uh it says go gain honor points for top places by kills and damage dealt 2500 that's honor points um and then it says capture beacons 18 i've got nine left uh it says watch a video obviously this is the mobile but these are just watching videos uh the last one is also watching videos i think this one because it's the mobile one it's it just gives you adverts to watch and then you get those things like i said this is not steam deck the steam deck is down here in that direction i don't know if you guys can see the steam decks over there got war robots on it um usually what i do is i mix and match so if i play it on this then i'll play it on the other one uh and so forth right it says complete a series of tasks and get a titan pilot what have at least one legendary pilot at rank two or higher only robot pilots are counted what completes a series of tasks and get a titan pilot what does it want me to do it says have at least one legendary pilot at rank two. Oh, then i get a uh i'll get a legendary pilot i mean a titan pilot just for that okay upgrade drone you get one point for that okay uh this one is just saying get achieve double kills i need to get 10 i've got one so far i've got nine left uh okay fine uh ultimate punish i don't know what that is right so i need to upgrade a pilot uh it wants you to upgrade a, a um okay so i i don't know if this one is upgraded how do i upgrade these dudes right so i'm gonna upgrade the this is the legendary pilot for um for mars it's the actual it's a proper legendary pilot right so how do you boost this oh use gold no you know what i'm not i'm not gonna do that <laughs> i'm not doing that let's see can i can i upgrade the other pilots no this is interesting because i wasn't really focusing on that uh this is also the neither legendary pilot and uh this is after neither used its ability it receives a shield breaker for five seconds these are the actual pilots for right so i'm just gonna upgrade all these dudes then i mean i've got i've got the memory chip things up there i wasn't thinking you know i wasn't thinking about these pilots because i, I was only focusing on um the pilots uh in for the titans so i mean these are the correct pilots let's see what's this pilot uh this is not the actual pilot for this dude wait let me find out i don't know i don't think i've got the opn uh pilot but let me you know what let me just use this just quicker right that's a mass pilot that's um i don't know what pilot this is let's let's find information about this pilot it's nightingale yeah yeah that's what i was thinking nightingale pilot these ones i know for sure are not this that's a lockdown pilot uh he's a um shotgun you know shotgun suppression uh legendary pilot i don't know what pilot that one is that's uh oh e emoji emoji pilot this is what i hate you know if you if you're going through them too much i mean this dude is for shotgun weapons i need to try and find opium i don't think i've got an opium pilot but I do need to find a pilot that supports the weapons that I've got. Uh, just makes it easier. These dudes I know definitely are not for opium. And that one, I'm sure that's... Um... I'm trying to think of the robot, this one, the ladies. Um, you know, the Fafnir. Fafnir, uh, I'm sorry, the, the Fenrir. You know, the, the tank robot, that's what she is for. So I know she's not for the thing this lady i'm not sure what she supports let's see mendes okay mender mender pilot right so i have to be careful now let me just try and look for a pilot you know what i i think i should get this lady because she supports um healing she's a legendary pilot for healing i just need a pilot that's gonna give me some abilities because i don't just keep getting these pilots that don't 
I don't know what this guy is. Uh, skull scorcher incident. No, it's gonna. You see, you have to be careful with the pilots because if you keep going into them, it's just gonna remove you. Anyway, the good thing is I've gone through most of these pilots, so I know they don't support nothing. So I'm trying to find a pilot here that's gonna support the Orpheon. Uh, the main reason why I need a, a proper pilot is because if I'm gonna upgrade them, it's just been more beneficial if the pilot kind of supports either the weapons you've got this pilot i don't know what she is for uh remote assault mass okay that's a mass pilot right uh those are scorpion pilots i don't know what she is for but i know she's not for opium i don't think i've got an opium pilot but what i want to do like i said i do have a lot you see i've got a lot of these uh legendary pilots they support healing so and this dude is for us uh, uh for the hazard decay weapons and blight that dude dead so if i had that weapon that'd be good for him but i don't just want to put any pilot because i could uh put the pilot there upgrade him and then need him later for another robot you know so if i cannot find the opium pilot i've got a lot of pilots here guys there's so many of them uh maybe more than 100 so uh bear with me yeah it's over now okay let me put wait i'm gonna check this one lady out i don't know what she's for oh emoji okay you know what um i'm going to change this dude and just go for the healing pilot uh because at least with the healing pilots they're not specific they're not for any robot they're just um healing uh legendary pilots so these are the ones that one Trixie Hope, I'm going to get her. And now the advantage here is I just need to select these weapons. Go with it. Ta like this. I don't know how the boosting. Ah, uh, no, I can't do that. So I'll need this one to be there for a while. And then I'll upgrade it. Right. So I want to upgrade this dude. Oh, wait. It says to change a skill. Wow. 100 microchips. Damn. Okay. Let me promote and there you go you see that's the correct pilot for uh scorpion so no issues there this is not the correct pilot for this dude but it says the robot receives a damage bonus the robot also gets bonus damage for every 10 percent durability that it loses so this dude here is not a, a legend pilot for any robot but it does at least you know it does work out for this robot so it's all good i've upgraded i've upgraded all these robots and I want to see if it's going to give me that pilot, the legendary pilot. Okay, so it says complete a series of tasks and get... Okay, I have to complete a series of tasks. So I did that one, but look, it's... Um, okay, so I have to... Con it says Titan pilots are rare and reserved for chosen commanders who are truly great. Size this opportunity to prove yourself. So I think it's saying you have to complete these tasks in order to get a Titan pilot. So I thought by doing that one, it would have done it. It's saying, no, I still need to... Because you see, I don't have a Titan pilot. That's why I want a Titan pilot. Right. So I need to complete tasks. So it says I need to get up to um, five battles. I think is it five battles that I have to win. So these are just tasks that I have to do, guys. So let me go back into that. I just want to find out what he wants me to do. Win five battles. Okay. Let's try and do that. But overall, I'm using this. Um, if you're wondering this thing, I don't need, you see, I don't need the cable. And look, I removed the cable. I removed the cable, but look, the cable is still there in the phone. And look, there's no cable here. That's why I said it's not the same cable. This cable is just to charge. It's just been used to charge the, um, the, 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 the gamepad. But overall, it's not the same cable that you're seeing that cable and this cable are not the same the one on the phone and the one in the gamepad is not the same right is it still working yes it's still working so i need to win five battles and then i'll be able to i need to complete tasks it won't i don't know how many tasks you want me to do but it's saying complete tasks and then you'll be able to get the the titan robot right so let's get back in this so i've upgraded the all of my uh robot pilots that was the first task it didn't ask for all of them but i just decided to upgrade them you know 
I mean, I, like I said, I wasn't focusing. I'm not focusing on upgrading the pilots anyway. Um, on the other, on on the iPhone, I do have a pilot, and the pilot there is actually on. Um, the pilot there is uh, 50 already, level 50. Oh my God, I got annihilated. Right, uh, it was Scorpion and Skyros that destroyed my robot. I had the Nida, but Nida's dead. I mean, the Nida is not even an MK2, you know? Oh my God, this guy is just annihilating. <laughs> he's, he's hitting me hard, man. This guy is not playing games. He's really coming in there. Why is no one helping? Look at this dude. My God, my mouse is destroyed. Oh, damn. Okay, what else do I have? Opium. I should be able to destroy him now. Uh, he thinks he's a badass. Let's see how badass he is now. Look at what the Opium is doing to this dude. Look at the damage. If someone just helped me here, man, this guy is going to kill everyone. No, look at the people. They're not doing anything. Now they're focusing on the dude. Only because they realize that if they don't, you know, if they don't focus on this dude, it's, it's, it's going to be a disaster. Oh, my God. Look, he brought in his, uh, his Titan. This guy is not here to mess about, man. <laughs> Look at him. He's killing. He's killing everybody. Everyone's going to die. So people wanted to ignore this, this dude, but he's going to kill everybody. Everyone's going to be dead soon. Right. So that's a Luchendor, a Balu Luchendor. Did you see that? He, he didn't even care that we destroyed his robot. He, he just knew... His aim was just to get his, um, his uh, Titan in there so he, he could cause his enough damage, as much damage as possible. I mean, we are destroying his Baloo Luchindo, but man, he's, he's caused so much damage. And, and look, they've taken all, they've taken all of the... Um, my God, come on, man. I don't want this. I, I want to destroy the Titan. Get me in the Titan area. Right, so let's destroy this balut <laughs> They took all of the beacons. We've already lost the game. So it's it's not even like if we destroy this Luchendo thingy, this uh, Titan will win. No, we've already lost. We've already lost the game. People weren't focusing much on this dude. You know? But we've destroyed him now, but we lost the game. <laughs> we destroyed the Titan, but lost the game. That's crazy. Look at that. How long did that match last? That, that dude was just, he was taking no prisoners. He just got in there, did what he needed to do, and annihilated um, the, the team. We got annihilated by one Skyros. <laughs> no, but you see, that's what happens when the team is good. When the team is really good, you can, you can do a lot. Um, sorry, guys. I'm going to zoom in a little bit more to try and get... Uh, the best view for this because I, I think it keeps zooming in and out. I do play other games on this, but uh, the whole purpose of this video is showing that I am using a, a controller while playing this game. I like playing Beacon Rush. So if you're wondering why I play Beacon Rush a, a lot, it's just I prefer this version. Uh, I'm going to try and minimize it just a little bit because I want to get a view of the controller because the whole purpose of the video is to show that you can actually use a controller in this game. I think it's zoomed out a little bit, so I need to zoom back in. And uh, I am using RB for the ability. And uh, RB is just the ability for the robot. But uh, if you have a Titan, you can use LB as well. The LB is the smaller triggers on your, um, on your gamepad. Uh, this DualSense controller will work with Fortnite as well. So if you play Fortnite, the DualSense controller will, will work there. But the one thing I, I don't understand is how do you get Call of Duty Mobile to work with a controller? Because I know you can use a controller on Call of Duty Mobile. I would, I would wish, I wish I, I could be able to, to, use, to use a gamepad, a controller on that game. Because, man, it would be so interesting to make a video of me playing, you know, with a controller. Look at this guy. He's trying to hit me with his spear. He's, he's really, really... He just wants to hit me with his... He wants to destroy my robot using his spear. You know, it's, it's like that's the only purpose of coming so close to me is with his spear. You know, I, I was like that. I've got spears as well. 
I mean, I don't know what they call the needles or whatever you call them. And, and I was really focused on trying to destroy someone with it. But, um, oh my God. I mean, look at this. Wow. I got annihilated. I don't understand what's going on today. I just keep losing. What's, what's happening with this game? I mean, are these pilots super good or what? I think it's because people are not focusing on the threats. You see what I mean? If we play as a team, we can win. But if people keep focusing, you see, I think people are focused on their own um, agendas. You understand? Oh, my God. You, you know what I mean? So I think that's why we keep losing. No, I mean, man, come on. The, the Skyros defeated us on the other game. And now they, they, there's no reason to be losing like this. Look at that. We can't, we can't even get... This is madness. We, we cannot even get a decent uh, a win. Uh, so the whole purpose of the video is to show that you can use a DualSense controller to play War, War Robots. So if you do play War Robots like I do, if you're, if you're a fan of this game and you want to use a controller gamepad, you can. Um, it's as easy as uh, pairing your DualSense controller to your Samsung phone. All you've got to do is press on the PlayStation logo and on the share, which is this button here. And once you've done that, that's that's basically all you need to do. Come on, where's this dude? Ah, no, I mean, he's not moving around, but it's just harder. You know, with the controller, you can actually force the, the my God, I, I hope we don't lose this game. I mean, you can force this thing. Look at what this guy is doing. He's, he's in a different world. Oh my god, look at that rook thing. Oh wow, he's, he's gonna destroy him now. Right, they're attacking me, but uh, I'm hoping like... I'm not even gonna bother myself with the other robot. I'm just gonna try and destroy that scorpion thing. Yes, I got it. I got rampage actually. So I'm, I'm doing my thing. I'm supposed to be getting double kills. So I, I, I would want to win the game. Because I need to, to complete that other task thing. But I mean, if I can't complete the game, then it, it's all good. Because at the end of the day, I'm still getting double kills. Because that's what I'm meant to be doing. I'm going to use my Luchindo now. Oh my god. Let me hide. Let me hide. You see what I mean? Using this... Um... What's this guy doing? What's he doing? Right, right. Okay, I'm going to use my Mothership on him. Destroy this Titan. Titan Slayer. That's what I got. Um, I'm just gonna attack this Seraph thing. Let's destroy this dude. What the hell? What? I can't believe that he's still alive. He should have died. He should be dead. <laughs> I'm serious. He shouldn't be alive. I, I should have annihilated this dude. Oh my god, look at this thing. Uh, I need, I need to, I need to help the squad because this is crazy. Look, look at the damage that's happening here. Right, I'm going to use my mothership ability. I am going down. I'm going down. But I, I tried, guys. I really tried. I'm going to use my scorpion. Um, I don't know. Let's see. I'm going to use RP. Teleport right behind this dude. There we go. Let me try and help them out. The, the squad. Oh, come on. Come on. Come on. I'm going to use RP again. Teleport backwards. What's this dude doing? You got avalanches on you and decay weapons. My god. I was taken out, right, um, the last one I've got is the behemoth, and uh, behemoth does have all these new weapons on him, I'm going to try and take out this uh, titan if I can, and if it's possible, I will destroy this titan, I've got two cruel bane, I've got the, I don't know what the heavy weapon is, but it's a new one, and I'm using uh, talon. And now suddenly they wake up, you know, the, the team, my team wakes up and it's like, oh, maybe if we bring in our Titans, there's a fighting chance we can win. They, they have to come at the last minute because there's no point coming in when, when we still had an opportunity to, to win. Oh my God, what's this guy doing? Look at that. He's just trying to annihilate me. Why is people letting this guy through? Destroy the dude behind you, bro. Bro, he's behind you. Wake the fuck up. Wake up. My God, okay. But why is he pushing me into the other things then? What's happening? Look at that. Oh, okay, listen. I, I know that I was going to go down anyway. 
I, I get that. I, I, I was going to go down. But this is madness. You, you get what I'm saying? You know what I was trying to do? I was trying to see um, what's going on. Okay, that's a Hemindel. That, that's a crap robot. Okay, he destroyed it. I'm surprised. Oh, he's using the Vajra and he's got the um, Cyclones. He's got three Cyclones. Uh, but that's the only dude we've got on our side. What's, what's the other one there? I think that's the Sphinx. Like I said, this, this robot is not that good. I know a lot of you guys, you want this uh, play, this robot. It's not that good, guys. I mean, it's okay, but it's not good. The Rook, I think, is quite good. But you see what the guy was doing? He was pushing me into the, the Rook and the, the Indra. And the Indra is the most, I think, is the most powerful uh, Titan you can get. This Rook thing is only nice because it goes up, it flies down. He needs to aim there, right there. And then get look at that thing it's like a bomb <laughs> it's like an emp when it hits the ground i mean imagine if this was a real thing in in the world it would be different right so right so this is i'm just going to show you this is the galaxy z fold 5 so i'm just showing the z fold 5 and uh, it's on android 13 at the moment but android 14 is coming to this phone uh, it's it sits flat you see it's not like the other one i showed you guys so this is the samsung galaxy z fold 5 got this for one grand uh 1.1 thousand dollars i know what you're thinking it's a lot of money well you know if you if you want the best then you pay the a lot for the best